Hey guys, uh, Jeremy here. Thought I'd let you know how I was doing lately. Uh, I went out and got an E-Flight Optera. It's a huge two meter foam flying wing. Two meters is, is gigantic. The thing barely fits in your car. Really wanted to push the limit on the endurance on that guy and see what can we do, FPV, you know, fly it out a few kilometers, whatever. Ended up trying to put this 3S 8,000 milliamp battery in it. Not such a great idea. The thing weighs 566 grams and E-Flight Optera comes with a 10 inch, 1100, 10 inch prop, 1100 kV motor. Uh, that bone stock, eh, let's just say the 8,000 milliamp hour, much less flight time than you'd think. 5100, however, which only weighs, you know, roughly two thirds of that, 380 grams, much better choice. I got this one here, ready-made RC, charges faster, good pluses there, lasts 12 minutes. So, you know, you got to kind of pick. My throwing arm is pretty good, but it's just not that good. So uh, find out what happens when you try to put that 8,000 milliamp hour in an Optera and don't do the same thing. Ready, filming. <laughs> That little test flight at CS Island didn't go so well. I was pretty anal about the CG. It was right on. So yeah, just totally underpowered. Well, let's see what I had to do to fix it. So as you can see, after a little bit of work, you know, a couple wooden dowels, a little bit of carbon fiber chopped up and some epoxy, put it all back together. Let's see if it's ready to fly. <laughs> 